generic questions for generic answers that we can use everywhere and get more publicity yeah. for the film. Right. So when you do your answers, if you can help incorporate the question I will incorporate the question, yes. Perfect. Thanks so, so much. Um, Stacy. Yep. Hold on one sec. I feel like Tesser, it's... Tesser. T-E-S-S-E-R. Phone is... S -S -E -R. Okay. okay so phone and who am I watching for time? Uh, that would be me. Okay. Got okay, it. it's very limited. Just I know. So you know. <clears throat> Stand by, please. We have sound? Yep. All right, and... But not the sound of this. Through. Okay. Yeah. Try to tell us a little bit about the challenges of incorporating the needs and the egos of all of those different superheroes into one film and trying to get them to work together. Well, the movie is really about um, a bunch of people who live in their own world uh, and are sort of the boss of their own world in many ways. Um, you know, one of them is going to be king, one of them's a billionaire. Um, they, uh, they definitely... Uh, they have these very weird perspectives that don't line up at all. And in some cases, they have enormous egos. And luckily, I'm talking about the characters and <laughs> the actors. Um, and the, the point of the movie is that uh, even though each one of them has great flaws um, and, and great power, uh, they really they only find themselves uh, through coming together as a team. And that, that it is the idea of community and something bigger than themselves that really um, saves them and us. And when it came to developing the characters, did it help that three of them already had standalone films? Well, I had a lot to work on when I was developing the characters because obviously I've read the comics since I was a kid. Um, and I'd seen all the films. And so some of them had played the characters extensively. Uh, but at the end of the day, um, you're looking to do something new with those characters, whether or not they've been played before. You're looking for you know, something people haven't necessarily seen. You want the things that they love. Mm -hmm. Tony Stark should be funny. Uh, you know, Banner should possibly not want to turn into the Hulk all the time. But, um, but you also don't want, um, you know, you don't want to just do a retread. So if they played the character a lot, uh, it was easier in some ways. Also harder because, you know, there are colors they'd say, well, I've done that. And uh, so you find your way around that. Uh, in the case of Mark, we created the character together. Um, which was really, really exciting. In the case of Robert, you know, it was really a question of, well, where haven't I been yet? And uh, which is a different kind of excitement. Absolutely. 